Okay, so we just figured something out. You can either walk past that sign and follow the arrow, or you can come to the back, and right here they have trolleys that take you a round trip tour of the area, I guess. And I think it's free, so probably just bring some tip money and yeah, it'll be good to go. So as you can see, there's a couple shuttles here. One's a trolley, the trolley's cooler. Um, and we'll see what happens, here we go. Looks like it's a scenic harbor trolley of now Willy Willy Town shopping, gifts, activities, Kalapaki Beach, restaurant services. And then there's this, which takes you to the excursions. It looks like Kings, waterfalls, and trains. Five minutes up the road, there are two shopping centers on the left side, Harbor Mall, and the right side, Anchor Cove. I go to the left, he goes to the right. at the Harbor Mall. Welcome to Kauai. All right, so this is where you can get picked up to go back to the ship. And so we're at the mall. There's a bunch of local stores, she said. It's not like big corporations. So it's a bunch of locally owned, owned shops. And across the street from the beach. So pretty good vicinity. And they come back a couple times. And the last stop's at 4. And we got to be back by 4.45. So perfect timing. Here's your flower for your hair. Uh, That's your flower for your hair. Yeah, buy them wherever you put it here. Yeah. Here we can get some cards and give it to the guy tonight to do the magic trick. Yeah. It's a cool little store with a bunch of different souvenirs. They actually have a lot of cool stuff and very good prices too. And of course, remember we're at the whole mall here, so it's like an outdoor mall. It's very hot and humid today. Even inside the store, it's pretty hot. They have fans going. Yeah, I like the weather better yesterday when it was cloudy and rainy. Okay, now there's this other store that not only has stuff, but she said it was like the best store they had or something. And it's also a post office. So you can buy stuff and ship it home or ship postcards, whatever you want, right inside, right in here. Just browse the Harbor Mall. Very cool place. Cool stores with lots of souvenirs. There's a lot of cool stuff in it, especially in that last store. Like there's not even just souvenirs. It's like a collectible shop too. So very cool stuff. No matter what you're looking for, you'll find something. Now, as you can see on this sign right here, there's also tons of places to eat if you want some Hawaiian food or some Asian food. It's Hawaiian food, right? Mexican food. I'm pretty sure one of these has to be some Hawaiian food. And then across the street is the beach and some more stores. So we're gonna go check those out real quick and see what they have. So right here across the street, they got Hawaiian shaved ice along with some Hawaii street food. All right, here we go, Turo Turo. They also have a snorkel rental shop. You're not gonna go in there. Oh wait, there is a, never mind, it's a gift shop, right? So there's a gift shop here. Fresh coconut and the Noka Grill. And over there, of course, the beach. Oh, so these are coconuts, homemade ice cream. After going through a lot of these stores, one thing I'm starting to notice about Hawaii, or maybe just Kauai, or maybe just this area, I don't even know for sure to be honest. It's like Mexico, it's reminding me of Mexico. It's very hot everywhere, there's no AC and there's just fans. <laughs> it's so hot. So now in order to get more over toward the beach and also the other shops over here, there's not really a path, although I guess if you go across that bridge across the street and walk over, there's not a crosswalk though, so I don't know, you kind of just have to make your way over. I think we're in a bike lane, unless this is a walkway, I don't know, it's a line for something. I guess technically cars aren't allowed in it, so it's something. DJ Now's right here. We got the Carnival cruise ship and the beach right there. What's up, man? How y'all enjoying? Yeah, we're enjoying. Nice, man. <laughs> it's nice out here. Yeah. We know that today's a lot hotter than the other days, I guess. Yes, the clouds. yes. It's like the big one. The next one's gonna be hotter. Oh yeah? Uh, yeah. Oh no. Yeah. I was fun. really liking the weather yesterday. Yeah. So it's yeah, it's gonna be sunny throughout the whole 
like the last couple of islands we're going yeah. to. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think it's been out since the morning. Yeah, we actually just came out like maybe an hour or two oh, ago. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice, nice. Just, uh, you guys ready to go on the beach? Yeah, we, we started over here and we took the trolley and brought us over here. Oh, okay. And then we're walking our way to the beach nice. now. Okay. It's nice down that uh, area, area. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, you guys will love it. Oh, yeah. I uh, will we'll enjoy you guys, okay? Right there. No problem. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. So over here in this parking lot, we have the Jam and Banana, which is like the best name ever. We got Maui Divers jewelry, crazy shirts, and over on the end we got the ABC store, which I've seen in Vegas before. I'm assuming it's like the same thing, you know, like a tourist area. And I guess we're gonna go check it out, see if there's any cool souvenirs there. And then I guess we're gonna have to work our way back to all the stores and get the stuff that we liked in each store that we were doing. Yeah. Yeah, so not over yet. Memories, memories. Also in here, we got some Christmas decorations to sit on and take pictures. This one's really cool. And then making our way past the decorations. Wow, right on the beach. Oh, wow, okay, literally right on the beach. Lots of people here, actually not too many. It's pretty tame, very nice. It actually is on, well, not technically on the property, but you know, with the property of this resort hotel, Although it is a public beach, so even though it looks like it's, you know, their backyard, anybody can go here. You don't have to be staying at the hotel. So it's very cool, very nice, very beautiful beach. Oh, look at those waves. Wow. Such clear water once again. Magnificent. And I like how it's not super crowded. I completely forgot to mention Kauai is the island that they film a lot of movies on, including Jurassic Park. And as you can see, we have Jurassic Shark as well as Kauai, Kauai shirts with the logo. Very cool. Inside the ABC store, I thought this sign was pretty funny. Federal court has ordered Phillips Morris USA and RJ Reynolds Tobacco to state that cigarette companies intentionally design cigarettes with enough nicotine to create and sustain addiction. So, yeah, you, you already know. I mean, I guess it's up to you. Believe it or not, believe it or not, <laughs> we finally made it to the beach. <laughs> finally, oh my God, are you so excited? And look, look at how much stuff she bought. Wow, <laughs> yeah. I'm very cheap uh, That's why you want me too much. Uh, so now we're at the beach. I mean, I, I mean, we need to try to find some shade. Maybe just right underneath this tree right yonder. <laughs> and I mean, it's, it's very nice. And one of the cool things about this beach is, let me actually try to get up here and get a better view. But hold on real quick, I got distracted. There's the Carnival Miracle. Like, as you can see, we're, we're right by it. So like I was saying, we have the clear water. It looks great, but the cool thing about this beach is it's on the resort, right? Well, splashing. So it's in the resort and right here at... Shoo! Okay. So let's hurry up this real quick. So as you can see, it's surrounded by land on both sides and over here. Goes out into the Pacific Ocean right over here. And then over there, there's also another blockade right there. So this is like blocking a lot of the wildlife that can come in here. So it's a very safe beach, very safe water to swim in. You don't have to worry about sharks or something. I'm not sure if sharks are in Hawaii, but I don't know, it's the ocean, anything's possible, right? Maybe there's some undiscovered thing, but half of it's blocked off right there, so they're gonna just turn around. <laughs> and pretty typical as far as uh you know, public beach bathroom goes. We also do have a sink outside to wash your hands. No soap is provided and you do have to hold the button down in order for the water to come out. It doesn't stay on for a certain amount of time. It just turns it right off. And then of course, we also have a little shower station to wash off from the beach water. But really, it is a very nice beach and within walking distance or trolley distance from the cruise port. So you can easily get there and you don't have to worry about rushing back to the cruise ship because it's less than half a mile. You can walk there in like 20 minutes. So we have to be back by 4.45. So we could probably stay here until four if we really wanted to. Now, one of the best things about the beach, other than the stuff I was bragging about earlier about it being kind of blocked off from the ocean, is that there's different areas where you can hang out. So as you can see over here, we got more shaded areas with the rocks. If you just want to enjoy it, we got some food over here. Then over there, we got the actual beach if you want to enjoy the sun, or of course, bring your own setup and cover up with sun and umbrellas. And if you happen to be staying in this hotel, you know, walk right out onto the beach. Pretty nice. Oh, 
look at this. There's a crab crawling around. Wow, I caught the tail end of it. That's pretty cool. Never saw a black crab before. Look at that. Actually, that's nothing, huh? It's just a pole. I thought it was a thing, but it's a pole. Okay, never mind, guys. I thought this was one of those tiki looking things. Now, something else I just noticed about this beach is this is right here. This is, you know, the ocean, the beach. But if you go over here, it turns into, you know, the beach, like the sand. But if you keep going, there's like a kiddie pool type thing going on over here. So there's actually, I guess this is like a really closed off area as far as the beach goes. That's pretty cool. And of course, as expected, chickens. Chickens, chickens, chickens everywhere. All right, just chilled at the beach. Now we're gonna head back across the street to the harbor. <laughs> to the harbor mall and get these souvenirs that she wanted, but she wanted to look around first. Yeah. So we're looping back. So as you see right here, we have Lige waffles, espressos, and fresh fruit bowls. Aloha, Lige, Liege, I'm not sure. Then over here, the house of sushi and lots and lots of chickens again. How do you think they have so much fresh chicken? Oh, and look at this. We actually have this. We're actually going to take it this time. Oh, there's another one actually over there. But yeah, a little bridge going over this little... I was going to call it a koi pond, but I mean, it's not. But, you know, very nice greenery inside, though. Look at these plants. Fantastic. Hawaii is just so green. Just such a beautiful area, literally everywhere. When I was child, um, my home in the back part is a river, and every time when it's raining a lot, it's the kind of lirios. I don't know how is the name here, but it's a lirios in Mexico, and I really love it. And I pick up sometimes and have a little bowl, and you can push it. It's a little okay. water in, water inside. Yeah, hmm. I have good memories. And after the too many years, not too much because I'm younger, after the too many years, I finally see it again. <laughs> it's real. Wow. It's hot. Yeah. And as it turns out, nice bathrooms over here at the Harbor Mall, though. I should have waited for this one instead of the one at the beach. It is kind of funny. So this is the men's bathroom. I was like, oh, it looks really fancy. Like it looks okay. It turns out it's just a single bathroom. I thought it was like more, so I guess you. Well, oh, actually, there's this too. I'm, <laughs> hold on, I guess. I mean, are you gonna sit here? <laughs> it's literally like a prison cell. I don't know what the hell this is, but it's crawling on me. Is it, is it dangerous? Anyways, like I was saying, the men's bathroom looked super nice up until I saw the prison set up as far as the sit-down toilet goes. But I was like, no, oh, it looks nice. And then Allie's like, hey, what do you mean it looks nice? It looks like a regular bathroom. I'm like, what? And then this is what the women's bathroom looks like. Completely different. It looks terrible. <laughs> it's kind of weird. Okay, I guess. Okay, I have a question about your bathroom because I was doing a tour of mine and then some guy walked in. <laughs> <laughs> but does your bathroom have like doors inside? Yeah. Okay, because this one's different. You walk in as the two ones you pee in, and then there's a regular toilet, but there's no door. So, like, you have to close this door or just sit there in front of everybody. I, I don't know. It's kind of weird. It's like prison. Actually, it's weird. The only time they remember that is a long time ago in one kind of bar, kind of like that, kind of club. There is the <laughs> open the. Aha, uh -huh, you can see uh, the women's. And they probably. Wait, what? Yeah, and the bathroom, All of them? the same thing, it's no, no door any. And I know, I didn't know what needed. Yeah, see, that's how this is, there's nothing there. Uh-huh, <laughs> and I feel like, I'm going to pee and say, okay, <laughs> everybody, you can see everybody, you want. Probably some glory holes in that club one, though. <laughs> <laughs> Kinda weird. All right, y'all, time to catch 10 or hang 10, do something. <laughs> Rocket power. Sha -na 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 -na.